Hi, John. You ready for C-Tech, John? All right. What's, what's going on here? Wait, wait. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, okay. with uh, quite a crisis. Uh, we're trying to figure out who we sign in as, and uh, I've come to the conclusion, we are Brennan. That's who we are. <laughs> I, I feel safe by the Secret Service. Here. And of course Brittany, because she's the powerhouse muscle of the group. Confirm safety on these seats. Confirm safety. Secret Service doing the job. Clear. Oh, these seats are so comfy. Oh my God. At Old Forest, they literally just put out like, like mats on the ground. <laughs> I'm like genuinely excited to tweet about this whole thing like the whole time. I like never go on Twitter, so it's gonna be fun. I like I always like tweet like with the walking wall. So now I don't know. John's tweet picture mate. He did it on purpose. That was like a long time. The lighting in here is not good. Hate it. Do it for the ultimate. Yep, there I am. Okay, guys, someone make it, is it Demario's sleeping joke? <laughs> How'd you guys do yesterday? You were like, all the way back. I know. <laughs> <laughs> so, Diney, yeah. Thor, oh, Thor's oh, wife, oh, you oh, made oh, it. Oh, yeah. 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 This is their school. Well, Shabak yelled at me for taking your phone because she said if your game's bad, she's gonna beat me up. She did it after you left. I'm like, just give it to her. Huh? What's gonna happen? My name is John Gelsomino. Today is a celebration of the efforts you, your peers, and your teachers have put forward all year. We encourage you to collaborate and share your thoughts on this year's festival by using the Twitter hashtag CTechFest throughout the day. Some of your tweets will be posted on the screen throughout the day. Just keep them appropriate. Also, if you need assistance at any time, and you can't find me, uh, please ask one of the uh, gentlemen in the white shirts that greeted you as you walked in this morning. They can help you out um, with any questions or needs you may have. Class Bradley Fishman Producers, Teacher Todd Rubin. That's not a student. Category 6, Public Affairs and Community Service. The winner is Journey Care Duck Races from Barrington High School. James O. Finding Myself. 
but through television, I created my own father, my own family. But when I came to high school, I found myself with the help of my only friend, the television studio. I became Celine Ararima from Batavia High School. The second place award goes to Ashlyn Kelly from York Community High School. And the first place award for Division AA Movie Trailer is awarded to Mike Skypark for the This one, this one will be cool. Generated imagery, hand rendered art, 
3D objects or a combination of techniques. Let's watch the videos. <laughs> so zoomed in, I couldn't even tell you. The division AA category shown in random order. In random order. whisking me away, the words of the world drowning me. As the ice cracks and breaks, my insides are dying, the ice numbing the pain. Oh, the, my, my vote goes to the NSA one. I, 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 I don't know about you, Jeff, my vote goes to the NSA one. The category for animation in third place, the award goes to Melissa Pratt from Glenbrook South High School with ice. The second place award goes to Niqua Valley High School for the NSA is delivering my mail by Patrick <laughs> O'Neill. The NSA is delivering my mail. I like that. That one was my favorite. That one was my favorite. And first place goes to Douglas Alberts from Wonderland High School. That one wasn't really that good. Choice of genre to use, but had to incorporate one prop and one line of dialogue into their short film and write, shoot, and edit it all within a seven-day time period. Here are the winning entries. Let's see if Bremen High School got there. Thank 
This one is really good. And it was actually all filmed in school. Yeah, I like those other two fucking cheaters. Let me try and guess the twist ending right now. He's dead. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Nope. I would have been. Is he dead? Is he dead? Is he dead? So is he dead? Just like this. Mr. President, sir, what do you think about the videos we have seen thus far? Uh, uh, my fellow Americans, uh, I feel like these videos are, uh, are uh, quite up to par. And uh, that's, that's pretty much it. Mr. President, I'm sorry. Mr. President, get down! <laughs> Such a good bodyguard right there, Secret Service. <laughs> and just disappear. Secret Service. Caster uh, stopped working. Edward uh, broke it. I wish I had lots of jokes. I did, did not. Right now. I apologize to my Glover North students because I'm going to sort of air our dirty laundry a little bit because everyone I think can understand this. So a lot of schools entered the seven day film challenge. And um, at, at, our, at our particular school, uh, we had basically two crews producing two different, um, two different uh, films. And we decided, between those two, we would decide which one would be our, our best entry. 
And uh, we're on the block schedule at Glenbrook North, so we do not meet every day. We meet 90 minutes every other day, which meant in that seven days, one class was only really going to meet twice, and the other class would meet three total times. And so for like many of oh, the lights are going down. Cut my story short. Save that story. I'll save that story for later. No? Yes, here we go. Personal story. All right, I'll keep telling the story until they're done. So, um, like many of you, the first step was trying to figure out a little bit about the process and, and how we were going to put this all together, and uh, this was the first year of this. And we've done short films with two, three people before, but having 12 working on one and I think 13 working on another um, was definitely a challenge. And um, in both our classes and both groups that were putting it on, and I don't know if this happened in some of your classes, um, they wrote a script, and then within about a day, personal story is awarded to Michael McAfee and Tucker Doyle from Lake Forest High School for Aaron Haley performing at O'Hare. When I was in high school, I went to Walla High. And they had bands, so I took band. The only instrument they had left was sax. Man, I started getting into groups and started jamming. Next thing you know, man, I'm hooked.
don't get it. <laughs> this entire bit was just sound like a dick, but no. All right, here we go. In third place, the award goes to Clayton Horwitz from Glenbrook South High School with Cash Grab. <laughs> and in second place, the award goes to Glenbrook South High School for the Robin Hood High School. All right, Wilson got it. You're going to get to see it here, people. Just wait. We get to watch it. And the first place award at Division A for Comedic Narrative is awarded to John Giorganis and Oakley Bunce for Nico Valley High School. Yeah! All right, here we, all right, here we go. He so much hard in my life. He gets made fun of every day by multiple kids. But uh, every day, Wilson, he just shows up to school and he has a smile on his face. And positive attitude, and I really look up to him for it. <laughs> <laughs> you get that mask. I won't work. Our son Wilson was born. I went into labor a month early. <laughs> 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 we didn't know how scared we were actually going to be. Just stay in the living. 
Um, Wilson has a team of doctors that he works with. <laughs> friend.
was awesome. I don't know, John, what do you think? I thought that was a very fun festival. Last and a half. It was. That was amazing, wasn't it, Edward? Fantastic. Did you like it, Niall? It was so cool. That really was. Those videos were really cool. I need to buy it. Those videos were really good. I really enjoyed that field trip, this field trip. Hello, BHSD, um, BTV. We had a wonderful time at the SeaTech. Um, we'll love to do it again, but we're leaving, so bye!